I'm Tyler Rowland. This is where you meet the athletes. And I'm with Matthew Wilson, safety for West Jessamine. And we thank you for being on, Matthew. And first off, um, talk a little bit about your program and what you like about West Jessamine and playing for Coach Marsh. I'd say one of the, my favorite things about West Jessamine would probably be the brotherhood we have between all the guys and how close we are. And we, we keep our heads up even when we're down, which I'm really proud of for this team this year. And I love playing for Coach Marsh. Uh, I think he he knows as much about football um, as anyone else, really. And I think that he keeps us together and he helps us grow as a team. Mm -hmm. A lot of youth that look up to you in the community. As a safety, what is something you feel like that has worked to, to help you succeed at the position? Uh, I would feel like playing the next play. I mean, you're not gonna you're not gonna be perfect in every game. You're gonna fail. So I think proceeding to the next play and uh, having confidence that your guys have your back and being ready to just move on even when you give one up, but be ready to come back next play ready to hit. So. Mm -hmm. And talk about the development of the program because you're in what, junior, senior? I'm a senior. Okay, you're a senior. senior. And talk about the development of the program and, and because just a few years ago this program was winless and now they, you guys have gone on to be, uh, to be, be quite, a, quite a good football program. Yeah, um, I think it has a lot to do with the coaching staff. I came on my freshman year, um, and I've had Coach Marsh all four years of my high school career, and uh, I think it's Coach Marsh, the way he handles stuff in the off season and during the season, and the mentality he has us form throughout the whole process. I think that speaks volume for our schedules and how much better we've done over the past couple of years. And what's something, Matthew, you feel like maybe an obstacle that you've overcome? Um, it could be on or off the field. I think for me, it was uh, it was probably confidence for me. I think uh, in years past, I haven't been as comfortable in the system as I am this year, and I think it kind of a lot of that had to do with my time off the field and how much I had on my plate, and I've kind of just been better about compartmentalizing it and, you know, saying when I'm at football, I'm giving football my all, and I'm focusing on only football while I'm there. So, What's maybe a hobby you have or maybe a cool accomplishment like off the field, maybe something academic? Um, something academic. I went to the Governor's Scholar Program this year, so, uh, gover so academics are pretty important to me, and that's the way I've been raised in my family. Academics are important. But I'd say any free time I have, I love to hunt and fish. And what's something, um, maybe a cool fact about yourself, not a lot of people know? Um, I would say the people closest to me know that my best friend's my grandfather. So that's, yeah, that's something that not maybe everyone knows in terms of people who see me on the outside, but that's my best friend. So yeah. fortunate for that. And, and lastly, are there any, any shout outs you'd like to give? Uh, yeah, um, all glory to God. You know, I'm firm in my faith and I'm, believe what I believe and I stand by that and thank you Lord for all he's blessed me with so all my glory goes to God. That's awesome brother well we thank you for being on and be sure to stay tuned see Matthew and see this uh, see this West Jasmine team they've been a lot of a lot of fun to get to cover over the past couple years and we thank you for watching I'm Tyler Rowland this is where you meet the athletes.